Hi guys, so <clears throat> I wanted to do a video for you guys um, all of last week and a lot of other things, but I've been really sick. Um, I am feeling better, well, quite a bit better. So today's video, instead of a haul or a cage tour, I decided what I would do um, is show you how I clean the pet room. Now, I'm not going to show you in detail. I'm going to explain what I'm going to do, then I'm going to fast forward through it. So let's go to the pet room. Oh, I can hear them making noise in there. Now, please mind you that the pet room hasn't been cleaned since yesterday, uh, yesterday morning, and it is now, what's today? I don't even know, to, in the afternoon of the next day. So, um, as you can see, it is a mess. Sorry for the lighting. It's, we only have one window in this room, but it, it really does light everything up pretty well. So, as you can see, there's poop everywhere. I'm actually just going to shut this blind really quickly because it's making the lighting really weird. I'm not going to shut it all the way, all the way, just halfway. There we go. That's a little better. So you can see there's just poops just about everywhere. Uh, they've knocked everything the wrong way, the right way. So the first thing that I recommend if you have a pet room and you let your bunnies have free room is to take everything out and put it away. Um, so what I do is I, and if you can't do that, that's okay. Some people can put everything into one corner of the room and stuff. Um, what I normally do is I take like these tunnels and stuff out, um, move the little things and stuff so that I can sweep around it. So now that's what I'm going to do is move everything around so that I have more of an open area. As you can see, everything's chewed up. I've got the broom there and the dustpan hanging up there. So yes. Alright, so as you can see, I moved all of their chew toys pretty much into that litter box. I put one of their cozies in that litter box. It was just easier to do it that way and everything else went on the other side there. Um, so now as you can see, it's just it's gross um for the most part they do use their litter box honestly but i mean with four bunnies it, it does get pretty messy um but they usually always pee in the litter box here and there there'll be accidents and stuff but other than that they're pretty good so now the next task is to sweep so i will be right back to show you all of the swept up cleanness now that it's pretty much been swept into one pile, what I do, hi bunnies, is I put it all into one of their litter boxes because it is most of their poop, which helps them to know to use their litter boxes. Um, I do two weekly litter box change outs. Uh, it helps reduce the smell and it helps keep things cleaner. Um, because I used to do it every other day, but they started to stop using their litter box completely. I don't know if it's because they couldn't smell their scent or what. Hi, right, jack and beans. Um, so now I just do it twice a week and they do a little bit better with their litter boxes. Tulu's over there. But if you can's there, Jack's there, Sally's here. Uh, so I'm gonna sweep that up and throw it in the litter boxes and then I'm gonna put everything down and I'll show you how it looks. All right, so I've now put everything back out. I just change it around just a little bit. Um, <clears throat> so in this litter box, I put some more hay and in that litter box, I put more hay, put some new food out. They've got their other big litter box there, their little cat thingy, I don't know. And their chew bowl that has all their chews in it. Just some odds and ends, things here and there. Oops, actually, I almost forgot to put out their two dogs. I can't remember where I got this coming from. That one I think is from Ocean State Job Lot. I think it was like five dollars, if even that. Um, it's pretty good. They like it because it makes the noise. This one I think was part of a ladybug tent set at Walmart for twenty. I used the tent set like twice and then I threw it away because I hated it. So did the bunnies. So now they got two of their tunnels. I might move one of them later actually. But yeah, so that is how I clean the bunny room. And <coughs> excuse me. So I just, yeah, it's pretty simple. I've actually had to take that potty pad out of there and left that there. I don't really do anything special. Um, it's just easier to uh, keep things simple. I change things around a lot for them because the more variety, the better. Um, because I don't have an air conditioner, I only have a fan in this room, 
I have these tiles that I got from builddirect.com. They're free. Um, they're, you can pick any sample. You get five different samples. I have like 20 of them because you can keep asking for them over and over and they'll keep sending them to you. Um, so I put these in the freezer and then I put them out here wrapped in paper towel so they can lay on them and keep cool. So yeah, thanks for watching.